Hello and welcome to Melossa, a unique YouTube channel where you'll find tons of interesting and unique canine content. Make sure you subscribe to our channel and feel free to leave a comment on any of our videos. In this episode, we'll take a look at the Serbian defense dog. The breed is a recreation of the old Serbian Mastiff from the Middle Ages. It was developed by Nenad Gavrilovic, a Bosnian herbalist and medicine man in the early 1980s, but the final standard was written in 1991. The breed has an interesting makeup, consisting of Serbian wolves, working Bosnian tornyaks, German Rottweilers, Neapolitan Mastiffs, American Staffordshire Terriers, and game-bred Pitbull Terriers. The lifespan of a Serbian defense dog is impressively long, with claims of 18 to 20 years with little-known genetic health issues associated with the breed. You can expect to pay from £1,500 upwards for an imported dog to the UK, and that price will most certainly increase depending on the quality. Gavrilovitz created a breed of immense physical strength, fantastic guarding instincts and impressive fighting abilities. The size of this breed is around 70 centimeters tall and weighing approximately 60 kilograms, with males sometimes exceeding this. The most distinguishing feature in the appearance of this breed is it has an exceptionally large head and a powerful muzzle. The chest is deep and broad, and from a distance one would be forgiven if you mistook the silhouette with a boa ball. The breed comes in a range of colors such as fawn, wheaten and red, yellow, brindle, black, gray, black and tan, and blue, with many displaying wolf markings on the face and mask. The coat can come in two types, a short coat, which is sometimes referred to as the bully style, and a medium coat. Regardless of the coat, it is double-layered, and the undercoat is thick and dense. Compared to other more popular dog breeds, there is generally less publications and information about the Serbian defense dog. The Serbian Defense Dog, or the SDD for short, is a rather rare breed and is not commonly seen outside of the Balkans. However, more recently there has been a rise in SDDs in countries much further afield. This is especially the case for the UK, where the number of SDDs are increasing. The breed has immense physical strength and stamina and heightened senses, and is very loyal to its master and family. The SDD gets along well with children, but should always be supervised, just like any other breed. Although, please note, they can be dog aggressive. The breed is intelligent with a stubborn streak. Any handler that shows weakness or lacks respect for this breed will have one hell of a time trying to train this formidable beast. Good leash training is a must due to the size and strength of this breed. If successfully trained, then they will excel at most tasks, most notably protection and guard duties. Before choosing a Serbian defense dog, it would be recommended to speak with local breeders and see the dogs in action to decide if this is the right breed for you. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like and subscribe to our channel. 